Welcome to the Mujawara Sketches YouTube channel, buddy. In today's video, we're delving deep into the mysterious world of One Piece, focusing on a character that often flies under the radar Binks. Yes, that's right. Binks is the enigmatic figure tied to the famous sea shanty, Binks no Sake. Strap in as we unravel the mysteries surrounding this forgotten hero and explore the connections to the final island and the One Piece treasure. One particular mystery in the world of One Piece that not many fans wonder about is the person called Binks. Binks is an intriguing character that has been brought up in the story quite a few times, however, very sneakily by Oda. The most obvious mention of this person comes through a very famous sea shanty in the One Piece world, Binks's Brew, also known as Binks no Sake. Many people dismiss this song as a mere sea shanty for pirates, but it actually holds a deeper meaning that relates to the person named Binks, who may have lived in the One Piece world long ago. Part 1. Who is Binks? The name of the song, Binks no Sake, gives away the fact that Binks was a real person who lived a long time ago. Shanks told Luffy that pirates used to sing the song all the time. Brooke used to sing the song with his friends all the time. He's even older than Shanks and a lot older than people like Roger. In other words, the song about Binks is almost 100 years old, and fans still know that pirates have been singing it for a long time. In other words, this isn't just a shandy it's a real theme that pirates have loved for generations. One of the first things that comes to mind when listening to the lyrics of Binks no Sake is who this person was, what they did, and what the trip was all about. It's clear that Binks no Sake is a pirate song. If you think that Binks lived a long time ago, mainly in the void century of the One Piece world, then the songs tell fans the real story about this person. For example, the song makes it sound like there were pirates in the world of One Piece a long time ago, just like there are now. They sailed the seas and had fun experiences all the time. Bink's drink was expected to be brought, indicating that Binks either crafted this unique alcohol or it possessed some other special quality. It might have been unique because it brought people from all over the world together. When you think about it more, the song also warns sailors about the dangers of the ocean and the end of a very bad thing. Those who stand up to it may face hardships or even be crushed, but tomorrow's sun will always be there. There will always be a better day ahead for the soldiers, even if they happen to die. Even though everyone has to turn into a skeleton in the end, the never-ending stories will always be a joke. It's pretty clear from this song that there is a connection between the One Piece and the final island, which is where Roger found the One Piece. Still, it's clear that in Binks's sake, the pirates who sail the seas dare to challenge it. In the end, they are defeated, but they refuse to give up. Despite their defeat, they pass on their will to someone else, ensuring that their stories of joy and adventure, as well as their history, live on. The funny stories are called Laugh Tales, and the background of them holds the key to One Piece. That's what they left on the last island, and it's likely also where Binks Sake is. Part 2, Binks, Joy Boy, and Nika. Now the question arises as to who this person named Binks really is. Most likely, fans will not be able to figure this out at first, but Binks is the same person as Joy Boy and Nika. For one thing, fans already know that Joy Boy is not a real person but rather a title that was given to that person a long time ago. Fans can also see that Joy Boy and Nika are the same person. For one thing, fans already know that Joy Boy is not a real person but rather a title that was given to that person a long time ago. Fans can also see that Joy Boy and Nika are the same person. However, neither Joy Boy nor Nika were his real names. In other words, the person's real name is still unknown. But if you connect it to the sea song, you can easily figure out what their name is. This person was Binks, and they were from the D family. Binks, who helped other people, was not only the first Nika but also the person who earned the title of Joy Boy. Binks fought against the world government, and he had a lot of people on his side. These friends were linked to Binks by his brew, and the bond between them was so strong that it went through the ages. Even though they lost to the people who made the world government, this link between them stayed. Part 3. Binks and his treasure, the One Piece. The final island will certainly tell the story of Binks and his friends. Fans might even see Binks brew, which is the sake he made himself, on this island. Once the crew drinks the sake, fans will witness Luffy and the Straw Hat Pirates uncover the secrets of the Void Century, the destruction they faced. and the enduring legacy of their stories on this island there will be a beautiful new part to the story that fans will love. You can be sure that their story and knowledge about the ancient weapons will be in one piece. But the real treasure is still a secret, and fans don't know what it is. It could just be for Binks's sake, but it could also be something much bigger. Oda has said in the past that the treasure is a real prize and not just an idea. 
thank goodness One Piece is already in its final story. Fans won't have to wait long to find out what One Piece really is and what Binks left behind. They just need to wait for Luffy to get the last road Ponglyph and get to this island then they can finally put together the past and figure out what happened to the world. Summary and Highlights Binks, the mysterious figure in One Piece, is connected to the renowned pirate song Binks no Sake. The song makes hints that there were pirates in the void century and that they went on adventures. It's likely that Binks, Joy Boy, and Nika are all the same person. There were many people who fought against the world government with Binks. He was part of the D family. Friends of Binks has formed a strong bond over his brew, sake, that has stood the test of time. With Binks's drink, the Straw Hat Pirates may be able to find out the story of Binks and his friends on the final island. This island may reveal the events of the Void Century and the composition of the One Piece treasure. What will happen? Fans will have to wait until Luffy gets to the island and gets the last road Ponglyph. And there you have it, folks. The mystery of Binks, the final island, and the One Piece. As we eagerly await Luffy's journey to the last road Ponglyph, the excitement builds. What revelations lie ahead and how will they shape the destiny of One Piece? Subscribe, like this video, and hit that notification bell to stay updated as we sail through the Grand Line together. Thank you very much for visiting the Mujawara Sketches YouTube channel, buddy. We hope you enjoy our funny sketch videos and anime reviews. Don't forget to subscribe to continue joining us on our joyful journey in the world of anime. If you have any wishes, questions, or suggestions for our next videos, feel free to express your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you very much for your support, and until we meet again. See you next time, buddy. What is One Piece anime? One Piece is a manga and anime story about a young boy named Monkey D. Luffy who wants to be the king of the pirates in the world. As a child, he eats a devil fruit, a strange plant that makes him able to stretch like rubber. Before the show starts, Luffy goes out into the world for the first time and starts to gather a group of pirates. The main group grows over time, but it starts with Luffy, Nami the Navigator, and a swordsman named Orono Azoro. At some point, Luffy and his friends are known as the Straw Hat Pirates, and they go on many exciting adventures across the ocean. One Piece is a lot of fun because it's silly. Luffy goes from island to island around the world in the series. Each island has its own setting and theme. It's a pretty fantastical world full of animals that look like people, live skeletons, and other delightfully strange things. Within moments the group is in a winter scene, and the next they are on a tropical island full of giants. The show is full of silly and bright details. For example, Zoro holds a sword in his mouth, a scary military boss wears a cute bulldog hat, and people don't use phones to talk to each other instead, they use special transponder snails that can send and receive messages. Luffy is a carefree person who just wants to eat a tasty meal and laugh at bad jokes. Even though there are some funny parts in the series, a lot of One Piece is about freedom. During his travels, Luffy often takes up guns to help his friends and encourages others to do the same against pirates and government-backed military occupations. The characters in Luffy and his crew get stronger with each fight, which is typical for shonen manga. A lot of the story is about how Luffy beats a problem that seemed impossible to solve and finds some kind of secret power. After each fight, Luffy and his team get stronger and move closer to his main goal, which is to find the One Piece. Why is it called One Piece? The first part of both the manga and the anime shows that Pirate King Gold D. Roger is telling the truth about the mythical wealth called the One Piece. One Piece is the name of the show because Luffy wants to find the One Piece and become the next Pirate King. One of Luffy's main goals in the show is mentioned in the show's title. What is the One Piece? The answer to this question is still one of the biggest secrets in the series. It's been more than 1,000 episodes, and we still don't know what One Piece is. We know that the One Piece is the name of the treasure that Gold D. Roger collected on his travels because of details in the manga. We still don't know a lot about the treasure, though. There are a lot of ideas from fans about what the One Piece is, but we still don't know what it is or even if it's real. The One Piece could just be the friends Luffy makes along the way.